White House. And she's made it very clear that she is going to make sure that Obamacare is fully repealed. Congresswoman Michelle Bachman. Thank you. It's so great to see you and be back in Marshalltown, Iowa. I, I was born in Waterloo, Iowa, and grew up there and in Cedar Falls. And we would come down to Marshalltown quite a bit because my aunt and uncle and my cousins lived in Marshalltown. So we'd take the drive down and come down here. We have a lot of great memories here. And so we ha are having a wonderful day. We I announced that I was running to be President of the United States on Monday in Waterloo, Iowa. And so we are making it a focus to be in Iowa a lot in the next in the next months that are coming forward. We need your help for 2012 because I'm determined we're going to take our country back in 2012. With your help, we're going to do it. Because our intention is to make, with all due respect, Barack Obama a one-term president. We were in Cedar Rapids and Iowa City this morning, and now we're here in Marshalltown. We're off to Des Moines. We're going to watch the baseball game tonight. Who's going? Oh, got to go. But we're going to be here and we'll be we'll end actually with the Clear Lake Parade coming up on 4th of July. It is great to be here. There's no better place to be for Independence Day than in Iowa. Because Iowa is the first in the nation. Wouldn't it be great to have an Iowan for president? Yeah. I think so too. So we're going to be here, and we're thrilled to be here. Let, you need to meet the love of my life, Marcus Bachman. 33 years we'll be married this year. We have our youngest daughter here with us today, too, Sophia. Yeah, here's Sophia. We're the proud parents of five kids, and we raised 23 great foster kids in our homes as well. And that's... That's really what it's about, isn't it? It's yeah. that next yeah. generation. Yeah. That's what we're thinking about. We want them to have everything that our parents gave to us. And I'm so grateful for this country. I'm so grateful for this nation. I'm so thankful for our veterans who have served us so well. My dad served in the Air Force. My stepdad was in the United States Army. And my brother retired full Navy. I believe in this country and I believe in a strong military. And we're going to stand for them. We also believe very strongly that our economy has to get back on track. And it can. That's my number one priority. I'm a former federal tax lawyer. I get it how devastating high taxes are to businesses like the business that's here at the Maid Right. I also, my husband and I started a small business. We're job creators. What do we need in this country? Jobs. Good, high paying jobs with good benefits. That's going to be our focus as well. Creating more jobs. And my other focus is to repeal Obamacare. To bring down the cost of health care. That's the real problem in health care is the cost. So we're going to bring down the cost of health care. So we're excited to talk to you. We have this uh, the straw poll coming up in August. We need your help at the straw poll. Will you come out and help me? We'll, we'll, we'll bring around a bus or whatever you need. We'll pick you up and we'll get you down there. We'll feed you. We'll show you a good time. And we need your help because the, winning back the White House begins in Iowa. Yeah. Yeah. Never forget that you are the ones who will choose the next president of the United States. We are reasonable, fair-minded people in Iowa. And one thing that I have tried to do, and I think fairly successfully, is bring the reasonable, fair-minded voice that I learned growing up from the people who loved me and the people that I loved in Iowa. I've taken that voice to Congress now it's time to take that reasonable, fair-minded Iowa voice to the White House. Yeah. That's exactly what we're going to do. So I want to thank all of you. I know it's hot out here. I don't want to keep you long. But let's, let's sign some autographs and let's have some fun and take some pictures. We just love you. I just want you to know that. I just, I'm so 
eternally grateful for what I was given by my parents and grandparents. I'm actually a seventh generation Iowan. I'm what you call an Iwegian. Have you ever heard of an Iwegian? Okay, I'm an Iwegian, and it was the 1850s when our family came over from Norway and we settled here, and so we are hard scrabble farmers who have always made do and made it happen, and it's just a thrill to be able to be back here in Marshalltown with all of you today. So God bless you all. We love you. We love Marshalltown. We'll be back again soon.